Hey guys, welcome to Snowbreak Containment Zone. I'll do a quick review of Enya. I won't do a deep dive. I'll do that with a build guide after this video. So this video is more on why you should start playing Snowbreak right this instant. Okay, I'm, I'm gonna give you guys all the details right now. But first, let's go through Enya. Enya, by the way, is actually free. Um, you can get her through a special invitation. Actually, uh, I think got mine already. So the invitation is just uh, disappeared. But this one is uh, my other account. This is roughly a free-to-play account. So as you can see, the invitation is gone after I got her. So let's go back to Enya. So basically, you get her for free, plus you also get her logistics for free. So as proof, the logistics is here. Where is it? Here it is. These are her logistics that you should get in the shop, but this is free. And it has the two most important stats that the logist uh, her logistics should have. So attack stat and alignment index. Okay, so again... This is a good freebie of a unit for an orange tier unit. Um, she will really, really help <laughs> your account to start if you're a beginner. Uh, when we started this game, um, when the game launched July, I think it was July 20th last year, we really had a hard time really, you know, getting to know the units, the operatives that came in. And it was not, the game was not, as stable it was not as fun or you know as fun as it is now okay let's go through Enya and see what she does um you get her for free again logistics for free her weapon though you can actually use her um weapon in the shop um that you can uh farm for that's not a bad idea i'm not going to go through the whole build guys again uh, she's a free unit. She's good to go. She's very good to use. You're not going to use her um, as much for her, what do you call this, for her um, ultimate skill. Not even for her standard skill. Standard skill, by the way, is decent. Damage is decent for a free unit. But you're going to be thinking that you got her for her support skill. This support skill is insane because it generates additional damage um if you have stacks of uh, there's uh, what do you call it here the stacks you shoot at a target and uh, the, the the stacks is going to be natural order up to 30 stacks so if you have those stacks in a she will basically place a zephyr machine it, it generates a ring that there that it generates a stack of natural order as you shoot with your gun an enemy so there's a meter there that uh, says that if the stacks are, are full or not even though if it if it's not full you can use it so how, how are you going to use it you're gonna be using it through your using a standard skill so if she is going to be your support hero or support operative your um the operative that you're using will have the opportunity to add electrical damage to their standard skill plus this this guy here this uh support skill adds skill a uh, skill damage boost to the ring of zephyr okay because of the ring of zephyr okay so again she is going to be a good starter unit um because you will be getting her for free now that you're going to be starting right now so that is it with Enya. I'm going to be doing a full build guide as soon as I finish this up. So that is it. The next one would be basically um, one of the best um, operatives that we've had or we have so far. And it's going to be Cherno Orange Tear. Cherno Orange Tear... Um, best i think best boss killer so far as i have tested her um she's actually very good as well in clear out mobs not really the 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 crowd control type but decent enough that you can actually uh use her so she's a very good all-around unit you can still summon her we still have 
11 days. You don't have to summon a copy of uh, Enya because you can farm for copies of her um, for her manifestation. But you have to try to summon for this girl. So let's try to do some pulls here. I uh, just want to finish up what I have. Hopefully, I can... I'm still getting her for this free-to-play account. I do have two accounts. The one that I use frequently is the one that I started last July. But I'm trying to start out this free-to-play account. So I'm still trying to get her for the next few remaining days. Again, she's one of the best... Take note, one of the best operatives that we have currently. And now you have the opportunity to get her. So first point, Enya. Second point is going to be Cherno Orange Tier. But let's go through the, the regular events for a beginner. Okay, this one is one of, one of what we had before when you are starting out. Definitely, you have to unlock stage 4-12 to get any one of these operatives so these are when we started the game these are these were the only five that came out so very little you know very little selection now you have to get you know you're pretty to get one of these and the best to start i think if you're a beginner would be winter solstice yao if you're opting for a sniper for very very large damage if you don't have cherno Orange tier, definitely get Yao with her Solstice. But um, other options would be Fanny, Coronet. Both of them are very, very nice in terms of DPS. You won't go wrong. And if you're into my personal choice, basically during that time was Life Wild Hunt. Wild Hunt, take note, um, interfaces well with Enya Orange tier. So those are my picks. Uh, those are personal picks. The top two are usually the general you know, picks of the audience, like Winter, Solstice, and Coronet. But my personal pick would be Life Wild Hunt. You you won't go wrong with her eventually down, down, down the line. I already have Marion Swift for this account. She's also a decent pick. Um, the last pick I think you would opt for would be Frisha Hush. Long term, I don't see any you know benefit in getting her. But um, most probably start with Winter Solstice, Coronet. Then the third probably choice or option, if you have an option, is Life, Wild Hunt, and Marion Swift. Those are, I think, guys, the best uh, choices that you can choose when you reach um, 4-12 and opening this Elite Recruit. Okay, also... You'll be getting a beginner banner. So there's a beginner banner here. This will also give you an opportunity to get a... It's a guarantee of an orange tier operative within 50 echoes. But the pool, if you can check out the pool, it's still the five of them. So this is also a good way in terms of... You can actually do this on a later time. I think... This um this doesn't have a you know a time limit. You can roll for the current banners now and roll for this banner probably on a later time. I can I can actually spend it's actually sharing its currency with this banner. So you can actually spend for this one. Sorry, not that one. Uh, no, I'm lacking. It's in it's eight. I need eight. It you can't summon um one by one you have to have enough currency to pull for this banner so definitely this banner is going to be your last option because you'll be using your digicash for the banner of um cherno okay so those are so far the banners there is actually a logging event that i think you should um consider uh logging in let me just try to look for that banner. Okay, so Treasures in the Snow. Yao 4 Star is one of the best, uh, what do you call this? One of the best healers to start in this game. Uh, definitely log in and get her. Uh, she will work wonders for you down the line, especially if you're starting out. Again, Enya, Cherno, Beginner Banner, the Selector Banner, and the Log In for Yao are the best freebies that you can start off right now plus guys 
down the line in a few months we'll be getting the one year anniversary for the game so probably around july so it's a couple of months away so we have june and july so two months or even three probably or even less so again that is it guys those are the things that you should look forward to when you are going to start snow break now enya free best best freebie ever um more or less for the anniversary we'll get other freebies hopefully another you know another um, operative from the devs so that is it guys um what are your thoughts what do you think of enya i'll do a complete build guide after this one so stay tuned for that one thank you very much guys for staying this far take care stay safe this is the warden and i'm out of here